Good morning, happy Tuesday. Raise your hand if you have ever seen a deer. Yeah? All right, well, grab your Bibles, all right? We're gonna be in our devotional. My Bible's over there, I promise. See, told you, I have it. Uh, we're gonna be in the Old Testament in the book of Habakkuk. So there are different types of deer and some deer like the mule deer named like named after that because of its big ears have to go high up in the mountains where it's really rocky and steep to get some to forage for food and then when the snow starts to fall in the mountains they kind of come down to a lower elevation but because of the steepness and the rocks um, these deer are really good at balancing and it's really cool how God has just created them. But in the book of Habakkuk, chapter three, verse 19, Habakkuk, Old Testament, chapter three, 19, so big number three, little number 19, says, the sovereign Lord is my strength. He makes my feet like the feet of a deer. He enables me to tread on the heights, on the heights. What task seems too hard for you to handle? Studying for a class in which you aren't doing so well? Patching up a disagreement with a friend? Many times you will think that you aren't strong enough to face a difficult situation. And you're right. Sometimes you're, you aren't. But we all know someone who is. That's right, God. The Bible tells us that God is all powerful. He can do anything and everything that he wants to do. Most of all, he wants to pass his strength on to you. Some think that strength comes from within. Actually, it comes from above. God gives you his strength because he knows that you can't do it on your own. Aren't you so glad that our strength and our help comes from God. So, this is what I want you guys to do. I want you in a vertical line to write a word, challenge, all right? So in a vertical line like this, up and down, and that means vertical, it starts with a V like a vacuum, a vacuum stands straight up, you know? So vertical, write the word challenge, C-H, you know, challenge. Have a parent help you if you need, all right? On a piece of paper. Now write nine words or phrases that begin with each letter in that word to describe what God helps you with in difficult challenges, all right? So you're, it's kind of like you're making like, you know, like an acronym, all right? What does the word challenge stand for, right? So for example, you might get down to the G and G you might write gives me guidance for, from his word or gives me strength or something. Uh, the C could be, he care, you know, cares about me, kind of kind of thing. All right, so let's bow our heads, let's close our eyes before you do, do this challenge, and let's just thank God for being with us and being our strength and our help, all right? Dear God, thank you so much for today. Thank you for your word, the Bible. God, thank you that our help and our strength comes from you. When we face a difficult situation, help us remember to cry out to you, to pray to you, to talk to you, to reach out to you. Lord, you are where our help comes from. Be with us today. We love you. Amen. All right, guys. Happy Tuesday. I will see you tomorrow.